There she goes again, always in that barn, tending to all of the animals. Sometimes I feel like she never gets a break. Well, I mean, that's fine dandy to me. Let's work for this old man. Now you know darn well that your daughter doing your jobs on your farm is just a waste of her time. And if, if she enjoys doing my jobs on my farm, my daughter is most definitely not wasting her time. Our daughter's getting older and older, Paul. She should be thinking about caring for a child rather than some horses and chickens. And do you know how that happens, Paul? She needs a man, Pa. She's not going to get married or have a child anytime soon if she has her head in the hay day after day. <laughs> How can this be? How are you pregnant if you've been on the farm tending to all the animals all day and night? Of every day of the year? Like, I don't know. I was on my way to feed the chickens and I fell into a barrel of hay. And now my stomach is huge, so I'm going to say it was the hay. I told you it wasn't a waste of her time. <laughs> oh. It's a girl. Oh nope, that is definitely... Oh wait, it's a hat. My granddaughter is a hat. This just inspired me to actually do my jobs on the farm. You know I'm going to look quite dandy now as I do my work. Thank you daughter for this fine gift that came directly from you. I will cherish it forever. Grandpa! When is it going to be my turn to tend the rabbits? They're so cute. My poor granddaughter, you cannot tend to the rabbits. You don't have any arms or legs. I've been watching how you do it for many years now. I feel like it's my turn to tend the rabbits. I'm sorry, granddaughter. I'll be right back. I need to grab their food. Oh, look. One of the rabbits just escaped the barn. Grandpa. Oh, he can't hear me. Don't worry, Grandpa. I'll get him before a bird catches him and flies away. Look, Grandpa. I got him. Who are you? What have you done with my dear dad? And why are you holding one of my rabbits? It escaped the gun, Grandpa. It's me. No, no. My granddaughter is a straw hat with no arms and no legs. You have to believe me. I was born a straw hat, but now I'm a girl. You can call me Straw Hat Girl. My dear granddaughter, it is you. You must go back to the house and tell your mom the great news. That I'm no longer a hat? <laughs> no, that I no longer have a hat to do my jobs and she could take over again. Oh, what joy. Well, who's this beautiful young lady? It's me, mama. Why does this girl have the voice of my very own daughter? Wait, Pa, where's your hat? Where's my daughter? She is right here, my daughter. We were tending to the rabbits and one of them left the farm. Then arms and legs grew out of the hat and boom, human. She's now Straw Hat Girl. Hello, my child, Star Hat Girl. It's so nice to finally see you in human form. my papa. You won't be able to find him anywhere. I mean, believe it or not, I've, I've never been with any man. So there's no place for you to look for your papa. But I know I have one. I know where he lives, so I'm going to go see him. You can't do that. You're too young to travel by yourself. Okay, okay. I know I just look at all of the farms in this country, then I'll come back home. Okay, if you insist, but promise to come right back.
And where do you think you might be going, little miss? Oh, I'm just trying to find the owner of this farm. It's very nice. There are so many more animals here than there are on my grandpa's farm. Well, congratulations. You found the owner, and yes, I do love all my animals. What are you doing traveling the county all by yourself? I'm searching for my papa. Well, it's a small county. Maybe I know him. Who's your papa, little miss? Well, I think you're my papa. And how do you know that? I just know. That's all. Who's your father, little miss? You. You are my papa. You are my papa. Yes, I am your papa. I moved out to this county to meet you and you finally came looking. I'm so happy. Mama, mama, I found him. I found papa. Mama? I'm sorry, my granddaughter, but your mama passed away. She got sick last night and just left a while ago. Too late. No, I'm sorry. I love you guys, but I cannot stay here. Papa? Papa? Mama passed away. Oh, really? Because last time I checked, she was right here. You're here with Papa. And now we can all be together. I love you, Mama and Papa. We love you too, little miss. Our straw hat girl.